recover together, recover stronger. On to the latest from Indonesia's G20 presidency, where in efforts to transition Indonesia's economy towards a greener economy, the Indonesian Ministry of National Development Planning has launched the first green economy index in Indonesia. The Indonesian Ministry of National Development Planning presented the Green Economy Index, or GEI, at the third G20 Development Working Group event. The index serves as an accurate measuring tool that marks the progress, achievements and effectiveness of Indonesia's economic transformation towards a greener economy. This greener economic transformation will also contribute to Indonesia's national economic recovery post-pandemic and achieve Indonesia's 2045 vision. The Indonesian Minister for the National Development Planning, Soharso Monarfa, stated that the Green Economy Index is part of the six economic transformation strategies set by the ministry. This Green Economy Index is another milestone for Indonesia is moving towards a new economy, another piece that we put together in building up a green economy. The transition to a greener economy will benefit Indonesia in many ways. With a move towards a greener economy, Indonesia's greenhouse gas emissions could be reduced by 68 percent. It could also boost average GDP growth to 6.1 to 6.5 percent by 2050, push higher gross national income, as well as add more jobs in the energy, electric vehicle, land restoration and waste industries. The greener economy will also improve overall livelihoods and the environment. An estimated 40,000 lives could be saved from reduced air pollution while also boosting restoration of ecosystems, forest protection and replantation, as well as the expansion of mangrove forests. Principal expert planner from the Indonesian Ministry of National Development Planning, Arifin Rodianto, stated that the Development Planning Agency targets 1.8 million jobs will be added to the green economy sector by 2030. He also added that the transition will invite non-government actors to support the economic development and sustainability of Indonesia's greener economy. Kita juga menyadari itu, pemerintah di sini nanti akan lebih banyak bergerak tidak sebagai enabler government, sebagai fasilitator, regulator, inovator, memonitor, dan sebagainya. Tapi nanti lebih banyak berkembang, berterlibat adalah aktor-aktor non-pemerintah tadi, karena ini semua ada. Kita harapkan nanti juga semua pihak, baik itu dari pemerintah, mau non-pemerintah, termasuk media, ya terlibat aktif gitu. Ini akan sangat penting, baik untuk perkembangan pertumbuhan ekonomi kita sendiri maupun menjaga kelestarinya untuk jangka panjang. The Indonesian government aims to make the green economy indexes one of the macro development targets for Indonesia's national development goals and hopes to reach their target in the upcoming years. They cover together, they cover stronger.